This is the Higantes Festival. It's unlike anything we've ever seen before. Absolutely wild. Oh my god. And it's been around for a minute. In 200 years? These are the Higantes. Look at these things. Giant handcrafted paper mache puppets originally meant to poke fun at all the Hacienda owners. And they move. It started with one, and now there are over 100 in each parade and counting. Do you have someone? Seven minutes. We weren't supposed to stay here last night. In fact, we had an Airbnb booked that we just paid for because we couldn't get there. Thank you very much. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> the Airbnb we were supposed to stay at was within walking distance of the festival, but it was farther from the airport, and the airport was absolute chaos last night. This is crazy. <laughs> Which meant it was very difficult to get a grab ride. We've already been out here for at least 30 minutes trying to get a grab and nobody will pick us up. Two people have said yes and then canceled when they saw how far away we were going. We were like an hour and a half away. So after three hours of waiting and getting canceled on, we decided to go to a hotel that was closer and spend the night. Thus, why we had about an hour drive to get here this morning instead of walking to it. But as you can hear, we made it. I like bumping into each other. It kind of reminds me of the Rose Parade, how each of the floats has like a sponsor and it's themed. Each of the gigantes are themed. This one behind me is a car wash theme. It's just themed with like a sash and then a sign in the front, but it's so cute. <laughs> There's varied levels of showmanship. Some strut, some just walk, and some even dance. I don't know how they do it. started in the late 1800s when the Philippines were still under Spanish colonial rule. The Hacienda owners, as they were called, only allowed the common people to celebrate one time per year, and the people took the opportunity to poke fun at all the Hacienda owners with giant paper mache puppets. The traditions continued, and it's since been 200 years. So apparently the festival's over. Not the festival, just the parade, but oh my gosh, there's so many people. Hi. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. Hi. Hello. 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 Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. Get in, get in. Oh, get in. Thank you. Oh, thank, thank you. you. We're gonna have a big tour. Yeah, of course. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, this is my husband. <laughs> what did they say? Is that your brother? <laughs> <laughs> he said I was very beautiful. Oh, wow. He's trying to steal you. Yeah. Look, brother. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you did? <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs>
He said he saw us on Facebook and YouTube. <laughs> that he follows us. <laughs> that would be an honor, but I just don't think he does. <laughs> We're currently... <laughs> People love us here, it's great. Hi! <laughs> Hello! Oh, sorry, kiddo! Did you run into him? Yeah. Oh, no. Okay, too much is happening. <laughs> too much? We have more friends here in 30 seconds than we do in the United States. <laughs> Our entire lives. I think we're the only tourists here that I've seen. <laughs> They're not Filipino. <laughs> Okay, perfect. Everybody's gonna perform over here. Oh really? Yeah. Oh cool. Thank you for helping us. <laughs> we don't know where we're going, but these kids here who are on their way to church told us that there's a performance up ahead. I mean that seems to be where everybody's going, so that makes sense. I think those are the final six Sagantes, I think. But it might be the whole parade all over again, I don't know. <laughs> Look at these! Oh, you can just come in and take pictures with them. Hi. <laughs> Look at these things. Oh, it is like bamboo. Is it? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's totally bamboo. Oh no, I don't know, I can't tell, it's really light. Okay, yeah. these things are three meters tall and light as a feather because there's somebody inside carrying it the whole length of the parade, which was very, very long. The head is made of paper mache and it looks like really hard and shiny. I was kind of worried about the rain. I don't think that would be good for it. But then the body has like some clothing on it and it's usually made of like bamboo. I think these are metal though. Yeah, but really light. And I feel really bad for the people inside. They stick their head out in the front. It's so cute. Some people were like talking to people in between in the chest. And some guy was literally smoking inside of his cigante and blowing smoke out the chest. <laughs> More pictures. I've never taken so many pictures in my life. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. It is toasty out here. This breeze feels amazing. I don't know why I thought it was a smart idea to wear a sweater in Southeast Asia. I thought you knew something I didn't. I, I was just cold when we got up. It's always a mistake. I know, it was before the sunrise. <laughs> oh my gosh, sorry. Thank, thank you guys so much. Thank you. You too, thank you. I feel like Angelina Jolie. I don't look like her. I feel like an uglier version of Brad Pitt. <laughs> Hi. We've been to a lot of amazing and very kind and welcoming countries, but from the moment we stepped out of the car, people were asking for pictures, saying hello, and like the entire day. It's been truly amazing. It's, a, it's unbelievable. Everyone is so kind. So many smiles. So many smiles. Where are you going? I don't know. It's like a maze. <laughs> okay, it's so bright. It is good lighting. Yeah. Not when you put your hand over your face like that. I know. Which meant it was very, which meant it was very, very, which meant it was very, very, di which meant it was very difficult. Okay. So if you'll notice, people say Po. Po? So people will say like, thank you, Po. Oh, yeah. And it's like a, it's like a sign of respect. Oh, okay. So our driver just said, on the way, Po. Okay. <laughs> 